How does someone know if they're that type of person if they have that disorder? Is there, there's not a way to test, is there? Well, what we typically do is we will bring you into a laboratory and we will measure your innate level. So we will shut out sort of all windows, all clock faces are gone, and we just let you run your natural rhythm. Mm. And they have the same rise and fall in melatonin, just like you and I do, except where it's doing that rise and fall of melatonin on the 24 hour clock face is radically different. Oh, okay. For you and I, it's you know 9, 10 p.m., 11 p.m. at night when we're starting that melatonin crescendo. Mm -hmm. For them, it's four o'clock in the morning. So we can measure it. It's not in their minds. It's not their choice. It's a biological edict. Are you concerned that melatonin is becoming more and more popular as a way to solve lifestyle issues that have caused sleep impairment? Because I'm seeing loads of, you know, I'm an investor, so I see lots of companies now pitching me different products that have melatonin in them as a sort of day-to-day -day sleeping supplement. 